Oh, hey guys. Wow, that was unexpected. Oh, it's good running into you guys. Well, while you're here, I was about to say to relax, but while you're here, it's, it's boy, boy gone, gone. Healthy. healthy. Woo! my 10th video it, and it's awesome I love that it's my 10th video very awesome but we're gonna be doing something kind of simple today uh busy year I'm in sixth grade now so um I want to remember my shake 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 your smoothie Oh, I'm sorry, this isn't that. Uh, but I just want to say, uh, read some really uh, great comments from uh, these five viewers. Um, that it's just, uh, and I love all your comments, no matter what. Um, even if you're not in this, don't, I don't. That doesn't mean I don't like you. you. All of you guys are awesome. Thank you for being in this. It has just been so much support of you guys doing that uh, that I've just been doing for 10 videos and you guys are always commenting always so supportive so thank you so I'm gonna do and the first one I'm gonna read is Miss Chrissy she's my the, uh, the reason I know her she's my pre-k teacher <laughs> um, but she's also a very great cook she even has these little camps she sometimes does on the weekends uh, that are really fun um, but she also has her blog that kind of inspired me to do my blog uh, and hers is called Girl Gone Grits. Get it? Because you guys know the song Girl Gone Wild. So <laughs> that kind of goes with that. Uh, but her blog's amazing. I've checked it out. It is just, she's such a great cook, such a great f photographer. Um, and she's just so happy. But So check out her blog. So I'm going to read this. Um, My daily breakfast is always three cups fresh spinach, one frozen banana, one half cup of phage, 0% Greek yogurt, uh, one third cup of any other frozen fruit. Uh, about three fourths cup of coconut almond milk. So that's always that's always a great thing. Um, and one cup of ice cubes. Uh, it makes a lot, but holds over till lunch easily. Sometimes I add fresh ginger or other spices. Sometimes chaya or flax seeds. I find it easier to drink my veggies in the morning rather than eat a salad for breakfast. So thank you, Miss Chrissy. That does sound very good. I might try that sometime. Uh, next we got is Lane, which we had last week. What is what? What are we making? Okay, this is a little snack that I like to make, but before I work out, after I work out, or just maybe after I come home from school. Uh, this is a short thing he just wrote, but um. He's a great, he's an awesome guy. Check out that video if you haven't seen it yet. It's the last one we posted. So what he said is, you should try it with chocolate almond milk, but either way, it tastes like heaven. So I'm, I might have to try that because that sounds so awesome. I, I have Horizon chocolate milk, so um, I like that. So I might try that too. So next, and so thank you, Lane. So uh, next, I got my grandma, uh, which is the third video I posted. And today we have a special guest today, and that's my grandma, Darling Cadell. Hi, hi, Jess. Um, and uh, so if you haven't seen that, check that out. But she was a guest on here, uh, and she's so supportive of me. Uh, and so I love you, Grandma. <laughs> and uh, so here's what she wrote: Great video. Uh, there are 26 different parts, animal acids, to protein and all essential to build and repair tissue, tissue and muscle in the body. All 26 are found in animal products such as meat, fish, eggs, and milk. Uh, many are in vegetable protein such as nuts, beans, corn, soy, and wheat, but must be combined to be effective. Examples must be eating beans and corn same time or nuts or nut butters on wheat bread or crackers eating a small amount of animal protein with vegetable protein is also effective keep up the good work Jax, and shake keep shaking it up so thank you grandma Ellie. that was very supportive uh because i asked her to if she could tell us about protein um think and uh so yeah so thank you for riding back on that that was that was just amazing that was a lot, so thank you. Uh, next, here's someone that we just 
we we thought we lost her for a couple uh, for a little videos, but her name is Kay. Hi, Kay. <laughs> um, he's on her last vlog. She she was she was she's one of my biggest uh, viewers. She's always really supportive. She wrote she one time just wrote this giant comment of on uh, about almond uh, not almond butter but coconut butter or whatever uh, whatever it was for the first video. I can't remember what it was. For coconut oil. That's right. Um. So she was really supportive of uh, everything. So here's what she said, and thank you for returning. We thought we missed you. We missed you. Uh, yum. I make my own kefir and use it uh, it for the base. Kefir is supposed to be good for digestion, so you guys might want to keep that in mind. <laughs> also, I chunk up fresh pineapple, freeze it on a cookie sheet so it won't stick all all stick together, and when frozen, put it in a zip Ziploc bag. Uh, in the freezer to use as needed. I like frozen pineapple instead of ice to cool the smoothie down, but mainly use it because I love pineapple. I just love pine pine oh, pineapple. <laughs> I've heard pineapple is good for inflammation, so it's awesome. Uh, thank you so much. Um, I might even research about inflammation. I don't know much. If you guys know what inflammation is, you can you guys put that in the blog? I mean, post comments, whatever it is. That would be really helpful. So thank you. Uh, and then, and so thank you, Kate. That was really, really supportive uh, on how making that smoothie. That pineapple. I, I'm not usually a great fan of pineapple, but that sounds really good. <laughs> uh, and here's this other uh, person. She worked with my dad one, uh, in her this job, and her name is Molly. Uh, she's really fun. She's nice and sweet. Uh, so this is what she said. She says, I like that J-Rob, too. I use Blue Bonnet Vanilla myself. I think they're similar. Blue Bond was recommended to me by my uh, adver adverted doctor who said I needed that one piece that didn't cause inflammation. So thank you, Molly. Uh, so if you guys don't want to use J-Rob or you guys can't find it, use Blue Bonnet Vanilla. Um, use that instead or whatever. There's also different flavors of J-Rob too. There's strawberry. So I, I wish I put that in my thing. But yeah, I use vanilla on in my smoothie. So awesome. So that's all the comments. Um, thank you guys so much. We, since this is a 10th video, we have a little surprise. We're having this really cool con- we're having this little contest, uh, where if you put your email, um, where, like, if you put it in this box, uh, you'll see it might be all the way below, uh, depends on what device you're using. Um, you'll put it in there, and then, um, uh, gosh, you'll get a we uh, weekly thing, um, weekly post or it'll go to your email I'm sorry it'll go to your email every time I hit that publish button um but at the end of this month I'm gonna uh, get everyone who put it in there oh and by the way no in information will be sent it I mean will be share it unless you want it to no matter what uh, if you guys want it to I will but I don't think you guys want to uh, but I promise no information is being shared except that only me and my dad know so yeah, and then uh, and even if you have done it before, we're still counting you in, so you guys don't have to do it again. But if you guys do it first, uh, and I'm gonna draw it on the on the uh, video when it's, I'll draw it on one of my videos, and I'll get this hat, draw it, and this uh, first one, uh, the first prize. I'm doing three of them, I think, something like that. And the first one's gonna be this really cool dry fit shirt. Uh, it has like just did it. Instead of just do it, instead of just do it, just did it. As this little dancer doing like a handstand, um, it's really cool. And then on the back, it has this like boygonhealthy.com thing, www.boygonhealthy.com. And so it's not big, but it's a little small. And then seven zero seven O's, woo, with an exclamation mark. It's really cool. It's in this white shirt. Um, I think you guys would really like it. Um. Uh, I might put that if we can get it. I'm gonna. I might do a picture of it in my next video. Show you guys what it's like. Next to it might be a water bottle, maybe something like that. This is all related to healthiness. So it's all related to healthy, uh, not just like a cake that says "boy got healthy." That'd be really cool, but no. Um, but so it might be a water bottle or whatever. Or it might even be like a towel or like a sweat towel, maybe if you guys are working out or something. Whatever it is, it'll be something cool. I'll make sure it's not boring. I'll make it cool. So, thank you guys so much. This, um, everyone in the comments. 
Um, if you guys have any questions, any suggestions in the comments below, please write them so much. And don't forget that contest is happening uh, by the end of this month, September. And there are no mistakes in cooking, just inventions. Dee!